Have you ever seen a fish that can glide through the air or a snake that can spit venom with precision? How about a creature that releases slime to escape predators? Or a shrimp with a punch as strong as a bullet? Or imagine a beetle that creates a mini explosion to defend itself? These are not just wild imaginations, they are nature's incredible survival tactics. Today we're diving into the fascinating world of animal defenses. From the flying fish that escapes predators by gliding above water, to the spitting cobra that targets threats with venom from afar, these animals have evolved in the most remarkable ways. The hagfish releases slime to slip away from attackers, while the mantis shrimp strikes with incredible speed and force. And the bombardier beetle? It fires boiling chemicals at predators. Get ready, because we're about to explore the wildest ways animals defend themselves. Motixia, Sequoia. These are the glowing type of millipedes, which can reach 4 to 5 cm in length. These millipedes' glowing appearance is the sign to avoid this. These millipedes also have a poisonous chemical in their body known as the hydrogen cyanide. The amount of hydrogen cyanide this millipede releases is not enough to kill anybody, but it can cause irritation and a very unpleasant experience that most predators avoid getting in contact with. Flying fish. Did you know about this fish before? Yes, this fish can actually fly but not like birds. When these fish feel any kind of danger in the water, they swim out of the water and use their special glands to fly for a short distance. This defensive mechanism is quite unique and effective, but not only the underwater creatures are a threat to them, but various birds also act as predators for them. These look like they came straight out of fairy tales. Don't you think? Fulmar. These have one of the gross defensive mechanisms as Fulmar spit vomit on their predators. Yes, you heard it right. Their stomach is made in such a way that it stores oily liquid. This is the liquid Fulmar used on predators. This is literally the most gross thing that any animal or bird could use as their defense. Do you also think that this is gross? The porcupine. Porcupines are the third largest rodent in the world. These animals have sharp spines or needle-like quills. These quills can reach up to 32 centimeters in length. Interesting thing is that these quills are extremely sharp and strong that various African tribes use them as an arrow while hunting. They use these quills as a protection gear against predators. Although these quills don't have venom, what will become of the predators who get these quills inserted in their skin? It's like getting various needles inserted into the skin at a time. Before moving on to our next animal, make sure to hit the subscribe button first. Don't forget about the bell icon. The platypus. The platypus have the unique ability of locating other animals by detecting the electric current in their muscles. Platypus has poison in their spurs, which is present on their hind feet. This venom is not that venomous, but that can be unbearable pain. Animals with low tolerance levels might die because of the pain, although they have a very joyful nature in captivity, but never fall for their cute looking face. Never means Never. Spitting Cobra. Did you know that there is a snake that sprays venom on its prey? Well, Spitting Cobra is one of them. They don't just spray the venom randomly, but they prefer to spit on the eyes of their prey because that is the very weak point where any venom can spread and cause serious issues. There are two small holes on their front fangs. That's where the venom comes out during the need. Their cells have cytotoxins, which will kill each and every cell that comes in contact with this venom. Hagfish! This is known to be one of the oldest fish breeds that is present from the past 300 years. 
Their defensive mechanism is weird as they tightly wrap around their prey, making it suffocate to death. Apart from this, hagfishes have two lines of extremely sharp teeth. Their body secrets are a strange, slimy solution. This solution grows in size upon contact with water. So when any predator tries to eat this fish, their body will have this slimy liquid. The slimy liquid grows in size and stops the respiratory system of the predator, making it suffocate to death. Eventually, we can say that these fish have three different defensive mechanisms, which they can use as per their need. What do you think about this? Mantis Shrimp Mantis shrimps are only three to four inches in length. These tiny creatures have the ability of punching their predators. Their punch is so strong that it can break the glass of the aquarium. Now you can for sure assume the power of their strong punch. If this tiny creature breaks or cracks the glass, they for sure can kill their predators with their punch too. Their punching arms are folded under their body. Upon threat, they launch these arms like a spring. Komodo Dragon Komodo dragons are often referred to as fire-spitting dragons. They are members of the lizard family and belong to the Komodo Island of Indonesia. Komodo dragons have a total of 60 teeth. Although their bite is not poisonous, they have the ability to cause various diseases. Whenever the Komodo dragons hunt on a prey, the remaining pieces of the prey stays in their teeth. It means they have rotten meat pieces inside their teeth. So when they bite any prey, the bacteria spread fast and can become the reason for the prey's death. Parasitoid Wasp The defensive mechanism is so weird and spooky. This wasp lays its egg inside the body of other insects. Yes, they lay their eggs inside a live insect and make them its host. These wasps first inject venom inside the insect's body. The larva then consumes the body of the host as it grows. It seems weird to me. Laying eggs inside the body of a live insect is just horrible. If all these creatures amazes you, guess what our number one creature can do? That is a little surprise for you all. Exploding Ants This ant species was discovered in 2018. They belong to the rainforest of Malaysia. These ants literally explode when felt threatened. They don't hesitate to do it even for saving their colony. These ants are like, oh, you want to destroy my colony or queen? Come, I will make sure you won't survive. These exploding ants release a poisonous liquid that kills the predators. By doing this, they also have to lose their lives. Exploding ants show an extreme level of loyalty towards their queen. Do you think it is necessary to kill your own for the safety of your colony? Let us know in the comments about your thoughts. Electric Eels As you can assume by their name, Electric eels have a unique mechanism of killing their prey by giving them electric shock. How do they do that? Seems like they have the whole electric system installed in them. Electric eels can give an electric shock of 800 volts in one time. Actually, they have various electric plates inside their special organs. That's why they can produce so much current by being attached to the electricity. These shocks can cause heart failure. This is the reason all the animals who came in contact with this eel will eventually die because of drowning or heart failure. Deathstalker Scorpion These scorpions are small in size but one of the most venomous creatures on the earth. Their sting has neurotoxins which are enough to put a man into a coma. Although early signs will be numbness and pain but if you don't get the right treatments, it can make your heart stop. So whoever comes in the way of this scorpion, their death is totally confirmed. Various animals try to avoid this scorpion. I guess that is for sure the best decision to save their lives. This scorpion is an example of don't go on the size. Bombardier Beetle 
Bombardier beetles have one of the unique protection mechanisms. These beetles will shoot boiling liquid from the end of their body. This liquid is hot enough to cause a second-degree burn. How could this be possible? Does the beetle don't get harmed because of this hot liquid? Actually, no. Their back produces this hot chemical with a popping sound. That's how their bodies are made. Interestingly, their body size reduces after the release of this chemical. One of the interesting things is that the 4Y can spray this chemical in all directions. Animals should have to avoid this dangerous creature. Sea Cucumber Sea cucumbers throw their internal organs like intestines on the predators. The intestine is covered with a venom known as holothurian. This venom can cause death to the predator. Although the intestine wraps around the body of the predator to make it suffocate to death. Skunk do you guys know about such an animal that has a gross protection mechanism? Well, skunks spray a gross liquid from their back to the predators. This liquid has a concoction of sulfur chemical which makes it smell even worse. The smell is so unbearable and gross that the predators just ran away. It seems really hard to bear such a gross smell even for the animals. Apart from gross liquid spray, these animals' bites can also cause rabies. This is one of the gross, defensive mechanisms ever known. Immortal Jellyfish? There is a creature exist on the Earth that is immortal. That is none other than jellyfish. This jellyfish is nearly the size of your little fingernail. These jellyfishes can reverse their life cycle. They can transform themselves to babies and then adults. They never dies. You can't see them with naked eyes. Although the reason behind their immortality is still not discovered yet. Thanks for watching. If you found these amazing animal defense tactics as mind blowing as we did, make sure to give this video a like. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you'll be the first to know when we drop more cool content. Stay tuned for more incredible wildlife facts. See you in the next one.